So in today's video we've got another Forza Horizon 4 video as you can see. So if you do enjoy or you do find it helpful in any way, make sure to smash the like. Well, don't smash it, just press it. It's not that difficult. And like if you could. Uh, not like, subscribe, you know what I mean. Anyway, do both. Yeah, cheers. Uh, for this video, you do need skill points if you don't know how to get skill points then if you go and look at the video that I uploaded yesterday I'll show you how to get skill points in a very easy way very easy method very easy very easy and yeah so in this you can double your coins double your coins double your credits not on FIFA double your credits in a matter of seconds in a matter of minutes in a matter of minutes yeah not in a matter of say it's taking more than all right yeah um I cannot be fucking asked. I'm going to fucking slip my. Alright. So, first of all, I'm going to fast travel back to my house um, so I can buy fucking cars. I'm going to kill myself. Um, fuck, stop saying um. So, I fast travel back to my house now. The Gables, is it called? Yeah. And. Um, I'm sure that a few of you may have seen this video on other people's channels, but some people may not have. Some people might find it useful hearing someone different explain it. Or, yeah, I don't know. It's not really glitchy, you can't get banned for it either. So that's good. So if we go over to the auto show, then we go over to the Porsche by pressing jump to a manufacturer using the select button on your Xbox controller. You go and choose the 9 level turbo 3.3. So this is 150k to buy. You can buy it off the auction house, but I wouldn't recommend it because so many people know about this already that most of them that are going to be listed, they're already going to have the perk point spent and then you're not going to be able to get any money and you've just wasted a load of money. So you can choose a random decal or livery or whatever it's called. You don't have to though. I think it's got the design of this game in it. I don't know. So yeah, I'm gonna do two. I'll do two in this video. So you do need the way I do it. You need 20. However, you can do it for 19, but I buy an extra wheel spin for one skill point, making obviously 19 and one equals 20 for any of you that don't know. So yeah, that's pretty much all you've got to do you've got to have 150k to start off with as well um there is another no risk method well no this is the no risk method there's an another method that is risky kind of sort of not really but you know so yeah stick around for that we'll probably post that sometime soon so after you've backed out of your garage you want to Go and buy the skill points so you want to buy all of them on the left and then as i say this is the wheel spin that i buy uh, hopefully i can get some money from it oh sick 110k so we need to make 40k and we get an extra 300k so off this one alone i made 260k that simple in what three nah i'd i'd say three minutes Three minutes off my 300k. So I'm gonna go and do another one as you can see. It's really not that difficult. Uh, yeah, so that's basically the end. You can watch me do another one. Right at the end, I'll show you how to remove your car from the garage. You don't have to do it, but you might as well do it because you know you don't really want to let a Porsche 911 Turbo 3.3 just sat there doing nothing, do you? I mean, you might actually, you might want to look richer and look like a bowler in that, but you know. Anyway, that's the end of the video. Well, it's not it's the end of me commentating over the video because you see the rest i just repeat myself i'm just gonna repeat myself sitting here and saying um but anyway yeah it's in a bit
Thank you.